All right, we are back here in Omega Industrial Sector number two. In this uh, episode, which is episode 32, we're going to be uh, upgrading these or building out these mega towers as we get the money. And um, oh, speaking of money, we should finish building this. Almost enough. Traffic flow here is getting better. It's still not perfect, but it is pretty good. And you know, this city shouldn't need that much traffic in and out, so I'm not too worried about it. Add two more of these, and then we'll start building out our mega tower. Yeah, we're making fifty-one grand an hour, fifty grand an hour, mostly from Omega. We're losing a little bit of money on our mega towers, but I think we'll end up making money in the end once we're we get everything together here. Hey, Boo Boo. Uh, we need a little bit of money, but we'll be getting there real quick here. Omega seems to be doing really well. Yeah, we're producing 6,000 crates today, 7,000 crates today, yeah. We'll be able to turn on our third factory here soon. Plenty of control on that. In fact, we probably don't need four. We could get away with two, I bet. But it looks like we have enough money to start doing these. So on the bottom, we're going to do uh, education levels. And then we're going to do almost purely apartment levels up to the top. And it actually seems to work out pretty good. And the amount of time that it takes to build the levels, I'll probably make that much money. 50000 an hour is pretty good for this city. start building our apartment levels. This one's going to be all low wealth. Let's see, these guys, but there's no relief from work. All right. Well, we're going to have some more people in here, so... I had 50,000 jobs, that's crazy. Looks like we're getting some backup at these intersections. But it doesn't last for too terribly long, so I think I'm okay with it. More apartment levels here. Now these apartment levels are probably going to lose money for a little while. Or the, you know, these mega towers until I get people moving in, but that's okay. We'll end up making a lot more money. Listen, we're up over 200,000 an hour now in this city.
or over two hundred thousand dollars at still around forty five thousand an hour. We still only have about thirty seven percent of the city taken care of with Omega. Let's see. On this one, I think we're gonna put the park levels above the um above the Skybridge station. Caught all the criminals. Excellent. And it looks like we are taking care of quite a good chunk of omega or of uh, industrial demand for the the whole region. Skybridge stations in. It doesn't look like we have a ton of people using the tunnel, but there's enough. What we'll see around uh, seven o'clock is everybody leaves their house around six, so around seven o'clock they would get up to these intersections and everything. There's some using the tunnel. It's looking pretty good so far. Now we'll do our park levels. Park level. And we'll attach our Skybridge stations. Down between, and these over here. Now I think we have everything taken up that we really can for now. Because, yeah, we can't do one that loops around this way. Alright. Hopefully that helps people get around. We'll see. Still have, what, these guys are... No relief from work? Alright. Well, we're getting there. These guys. What is... This one? No. Next level. Well, they're on their way back up. They were, they're really sick, but they're, they're on their way back. More apartment levels. As you can see, our malls are doing a lot better here and here. Doing a lot better. Which is probably why we're over 50 grand an hour in our budget. We're still losing just a little bit of money, almost a thousand an hour from our mega towers. But like I say, once we get this one all together, I think we'll be golden. It's time to put on our last apartment level. I think we're going to put the park crowns on top of these, because we don't need any more money, or any more power. Yeah, we're totally fine on power. But we can upgrade our city hall again. We'll put this down. It's a pretty big city hall now. This is a pretty cool little mega tower complex we built. A lot of industry. These guys all have places to work and everything. And obviously we're just raking in the cash. And I think... You know, we don't really need power, we'll just do, uh... Park crowns. Because advertising crowns won't do us any good, we don't want... Tourism. 
And we don't really need power, so. Default to park crowns. Just had to refill my coffee real quick here. So now let's see how our happiness is coming along. Industrial says they still need places to ship their freight. These don't look very full though. I wonder if they're just having trouble getting stuff over there. That barely put a dent in our jobs. <laughs> Two full towers, and I mean, hardly a dent. Let's take out these that don't have enough Omega, not enough workers, and I don't. I really don't know where we would get enough workers in this this region for them. And and I'm not going to bother optimizing the building density because that'll just be more more industrial. Let's see. It's still worker shortage, man. We do have a couple little places over here, but I'm not going to put workers there, and I can't put more mega towers in the city. I think mean, there's just no room. Everybody's getting to school, though, which is good. How's our buses? Still not, not many people are riding the bus. So we'll let it run for just a minute here, and hopefully people will find their way around a little bit better. Um, we were going to build a bus depot in, though. Where should we put that? Along the back edge here. Looks like it'll work. I keep forgetting I have the chain plopper mod. It's so helpful in place in buildings like that. So once these guys get going, yeah, there we go, working. We should have a, a lot lower wait time and hopefully more people riding the bus then. Although I guess these guys choose to take the... Yeah, see we have a lot of traffic on our... Um, what if we slow down? Yeah, see we got a lot of traffic on this uh, bridge here. The sky bridge. Let's see here. Let's use this to help see what's costing and making the most money. These guys are all buildings coming in. We can turn this on if we want, but... Hmm? Some of these are costing kind of a lot, but some of them aren't costing as much. We 
We should see how our population is getting around the city, though. Because we need to figure out a way to get more people around the city more functionally than the buses seem to be doing. Which doesn't really make that much sense. You'd think the buses would be able to come in just fine. Because it's the workers that are mostly clogging everything up. A few shoppers, but mostly workers. And you'd think that they would take the bus because they're all low wealth. These guys are all walking shoppers. And those are shoppers taking the bus. Those are workers taking the bus. So I guess maybe we just need to, to let it run for a little bit so that they figure out that they can take the bus. Because we have work, four hats of education. Everybody's being educated, so we'll be fine as far as them, you know, being smart enough to take the bus. We're also picking up all of our trash and... We're mostly ke keeping up with burning it. We still have a few levels that are unsatisfied. Really sick. Why are you really sick? There's really not much sickness in the city, so I'm really not sure why you're sick. Maybe it's just all the germs? Yeah, it's all the germs coming out. Hmm, what do we do about the germs? This is all from air pollution. Okay. So what if we replace these crowns with the air scrubber crowns? Which I don't think we have access to yet. We would have to go research that. In fact, let's go research that real quick. Let's do the air scrubbers in there, because maybe that'll help keep our medium wealth people happy. So we go over to our research city. And let's see how long that'll take to research. Hopefully not very long. And if you haven't seen my research city, this is in Teligaria Mesa. It's a high wealth research city. Oh, let's switch. Yeah, let's switch this. We want Mark II Air Scrubber Crown. And this city says it loses a little bit of money, but it does a lot of recycling, so um, it actually makes money most of the time based on whatever it has to send out. Let's speed this up, and hopefully the research will go fairly quickly. We usually have more high wealth people than that. We even have some unemployed, so I'm not sure why it's not getting enough high wealth people, but it should be. 3% research, all right, this should go fairly quickly. It's okay though, we can update this city a little bit with the rest of the region. Got quite a few tourists coming in. This one's mostly losing money, but it, it's just mostly there for looks too. This is also our power provider for this section of the region. It's got, uh, what, 2,000 extra megawatts of power, so yeah, it's, it's really a big power powerhouse. Also got a university here. Um, I don't think we have anything. I mean, we have basically everything researched at the university that we need. 
Oh, that might take a little longer. So I might have to do that research off camera. Because that was that's going to take most of this episode just to complete the research. So I will do that off camera for probably the next episode. And come on. Take me over there. There we go. Let's just load up the city and uh, we'll continue working on this one. I don't know that we have a ton left to do in this city either. We're making a lot of money. We have most of our land area filled out. We do have a few blank spaces we can use at the corners here and the corners back here. Uh, I'm not sure what I want to put in there yet, but maybe, maybe we'll put something. Fires are just fine. Health is meh. Everything else is looking great in this city. Starting to get more people riding the bus. I think that'll help with our overworked issue too, because a lot of times that happens when people can't get to and from work quickly enough. Um, these guys were sick and we're gonna do that with the um, air scrubbers when we get those. I think if I put the air scrubber here it'll have enough area to cover all of this, you know. And what is... not enough workers. Man. I may have to take the ends of these and make yeah, in fact, I think I will do that. I, I'm, I'm going to take the ends of these and make residential, because I, I just I need more residential area. And it's fine that it's low wealth, because that's really, you know, what we want, but... And we'll take the ends of this one. I'm going to do the same on the other side in a minute here. There we go. So, did I fill the corner? Yeah. And then we'll do it for this side as well. Some of those might come in medium wealth just because of the towers there, but I'm hoping most of them will be low wealth. Especially with having so much industrial near them, I'm hoping it'll bring the land value down enough to just keep low wealth people in that area. But, you can see the corners here probably have enough to, to support some medium wealth. Yeah. The rest of it should be low wealth, though. It's okay, we can do with some medium wealth people in our city, too. We took out a good chunk of our jobs, which is great. Here we can plant some trees to maybe get rid of a little bit of that ground pollution. A little bit anyway. Put some trees in here. Now that it's night time, I can't see a thing, so I'm kind of just guessing. <laughs> I'm just fill some of this area up with trees, you know, make it look nice.
maybe take care of a little bit of our air pollution as well. another security breach at the International Airport. We should catch everybody pretty quickly though. And I don't believe, let me double check, I don't believe we have any access to air scrubber crowns on, on these at all. Yeah, because it's just the Mark II. buildings in here. Great. These guys say what? Shopping here is really good. Okay. I don't understand what your problem is. <laughs> Telling all our friends to move in. But nobody's moving in. Okay, so maybe this is just, uh, there's a little bug sometimes where you get um, six residents left in a, a tower level and that's all that ever happens. It just stays at six. In fact, let's take this opportunity to move that park level. We'll make this one perfect level. Why do you want to be bulldozed? Not enough Omega? Damn it. Show me. Not enough Omega. No, I'm back here. Not enough Omega. Yeah, we're basically just uh, not making as much money on Omega at the moment since we removed a bunch of buildings. They'll start giving Omega to all the other buildings, though, so it'll only be a little bit of time. Whoops, we need sky bridge. A little bit of time, and it'll come right back up to making like 50 grand an hour. Have 50 high density, low wealth residential buildings in your city. Cool. You can see we're shipping a ton of freight still. Everything seems to be going fairly well in the city. Happiness is still improving there. And then we'll build a park level. And then we'll connect these as well. This goes here, this goes here, and this goes here. What do these guys want? Shopping here is really good. Now, see, they're not stuck at six residents, so. <laughs> Let's see our incomes. We start getting more Omega delivered to people and industries and everything. Time to build apartment levels. And we still need just a ton of low wealth.
Although we're starting to finally catch up with it now that I've taken out the, you know these areas in this area. It's kind of annoying that nothing will build over here, and they and yet yet they let you zone it. I wonder if I can put like some parks in. I could. In fact, it would look good like right here. There. We can come into their little park area. And the same with this. I don't know what I'm going to do here. I don't want to put a park there because that's. You know, maybe I'll move these park and rides. Just to fill in this area back here. like one on each side here oh that's actually not good so I want them to be like inside the area where it won't grow like that Yeah, that's a lot better. There. Now at least it's filled in with something. And these people will be happy with their park. Finish off this tower with a final apartment level. Almost got half a million people in this city. Pretty cool. This part seems to be filling up pretty good, so does this. We can go through and optimize the buildings as well for those, as, as needed. And of course we're going to have the solar crown on here. As soon as it finishes building. There we go. Now, most things should be making money here. These guys are still... Shopping here is really good. Okay. I don't understand why more people don't move in. <coughs> Excuse me. Telling all our friends to move in, but they're still sick. Okay. With this solar crown, we should actually be breaking about even on our um, on our mega tower income. Should be pretty close anyway. Yeah, we're losing five hundred dollars an hour, so that's that's good. It, it should even itself out some too. What is blinking at us from the regional menu? Oh, great work stuff. Now see, I don't understand why it doesn't take more of our freight. Isn't that what the International Airport is supposed to do, is take freight? Or is it supposed to bring freight? It was supposed to bring in freight, I did this thing, this whole section of the region totally wrong. But, from the description when I read it, it, it sounded like it accepted freight, so... A lot of people coming into the city, and it looks like they're mostly just being dumb right here because it, traffic is, you know, flowing fairly well. They they could come into the city faster, but everybody's dumb driving in. So I'm not too worried about that. That's mostly just sim stupidity. And then of course this one is going to flow in nice and smooth for now. Yeah. 
So it looks like our entrance is still working pretty well. Let's check out this stuff here. We are actually making a little bit of money now. Fine on control net. And you can see our Omega needs to needs to catch up here. See that's producing okay. That's producing okay. I think we can we're making enough money and everything. Let's turn on our third factory. And then we'll be making tons of Omega. And hopefully that translates into tons of money. Let's see these guys keep dying because of not enough Omega. Garbage dump almost full. Okay, yeah, now we're getting to the point where we're not able to burn off all our garbage fast enough. So we're going to put in another another one. We'll do this because we don't need the extra stuff. Put another one of these on. And we'll put some of these in. And we don't need the extra trucks, so we're not even going to bother with those. But we will put in the extra, um, you know, burners. These guys are all futurized. I do kind of like this; these low uh, wealth futurized buildings. They look cool. Medium wealth are pretty much the same as, as they were normally. They just have some solar panels and stuff on the roof. But these low wealth ones always look really cool. And then what will happen is they should just deliver the garbage to either both or one first and then the other and then we'll be able to burn everything off quickly enough. And in fact, between this uh, city and the other industrial city, I think we can take care of the trash for the other uh, commercial cities when we put those in. Let's see. 2,000 riders a day. 1,000 riders over here. Close to 2,000, I guess. Huh? Alright. Night approaching. All right, we're down a couple on hats, I think, because we uh, we redid our education a little bit and we put some new people in. Those will come up soon. Ooh, water pump running dry. Okay, we're also kind of low on water. So, I think I'm going to redo this plan here. We have enough money to to do this. I'm going to take this out. I'm going to take this out. We're going to put this over here. And then we're going to put this right up next to it. But off just enough that I can put another one. Um, like one, two, three. Because this is going to need to be a... Um, one of these. Filtration one. And one more, six. And then what I think we'll do with this is we'll start taking these out this way. Oh, it's over. Damn it. I was hoping I could draw it across the back side here. That's not helpful. I can't wait, because oh, yeah, that's overlapping. What if we just do it this way, and then go this way? Is that still too close? It's still too close. Son of a bitch. Wish I could find a way to make this work here. Suppose I can face it another direction. Mm-hmm. Let's 
just like I'm supposed to be able to turn this one around. But it's not letting me. Alright, so that plan is shot. Damn, what am I going to do here then? Alright, let's take this out. And then one of these. Maybe if I draw, I'll do one and then the other. It'll make a difference. Six and seven. Let's see, that fits. Okay, so yeah, it's a case of being able to draw it. I have to do one before the other. Oh, and we're out of money. Shit. Okay. <laughs> keep forgetting to watch the money but we do need to finish placing these there we go and then we'll let the let the simulation run for a minute and then we'll place our other uh, sewage treatment plant over here oh which I'm probably gonna need to take the these other water pumping stations out. Damn it, I don't know why I didn't think about that. But we need a little bit more money before we can move the sewage treatment plant over here. Oh, whoops. Some some reason I was accidentally recording a video. Wow, there's a lot of people in the city now. We actually don't have quite enough space to educate all of these. I think we only have 8,000 worth of space, because we have four of them in the city, yeah. So, that's okay though, people will get education from the other cities when we put them in. Do not write on this stuff. People are sick, but they're getting treated very quickly. Yeah, looking okay. Should be making a lot more money in Omega now. Yeah, getting there. This one's still got an unsatisfied level or two. Where are you? You're still worried about sickness. We will fix you soon. In fact, let's actually take this down and redo this. So this is all three medium moth and proper levels. Okay. And actually, what do we need for. Let's make one of these low wealth, and then let's make the top two medium. Because we haven't... Yeah. There we go. Oh, and we should have enough to move our sewage treatment plant here. Let's start placing some of these. A couple of them. You can see a little bit of lag coming in since we have over half a million people in the city now. It's, uh, it just takes a toll on the engine. And I don't know if it's the processing or what, because I, I can see my my stats on here, but n my video card's not maxed out, my P CPU's not maxed out. I'm, I'm really not sure what it is. Probably just so much calculation going on. Well, we can take this out. 
Because we don't need that right now. Let's another one of those in. And then we'll put one more apartment level and put the the billboard crown back on. I'm not too worried about water because we still have some water from the region. It's actually all looking fairly good so far. These guys are all producing Omega very well. Oh, and time to put our advertising crown back on. And then once we get a little bit more money, we'll finish up this side. We're only at 24% so far, 25%, but we're getting there, slowly but surely. We'll take over the whole city here. <laughs> yeah, so now we're at 50 grand an hour on just Omega, 26% of the city. Hey, little Reuben. Good to see you in the chat. Alright, now we can put some of these in. Now this one will fit. Oh, now see, it's not yelling at me about it on this side. Weird. That should help keep this filled in with water. And it should produce it should then produce enough water for for the town for the most part. Time to upgrade this again. Uh, and we want to put this one right over here. Fully upgraded Omega Co. Looks pretty cool. Whole cities, another one of these industrial cities where it's all purple and red lights and, you know, neon industry, high density, you know, all that stuff. Still got a lot of jobs and everything, but we basically have no more way, not a lot of ways to get more people in the city. Uh, unless we we rezone back here again and make them all com all people back here, and even then, I don't think we're gonna have enough people for all our jobs. These guys are all complaining about sick. Yeah, it's gonna sick need a doctor. Germs are bad for our health. Probably the same with these guys over here. Yeah, really sick. Tower's great. Tower's great. Yeah, it's just the sick people at the top that are unhappy. And we'll, we'll take care of that with our air scrubber crowns. And I'm debating either putting them on these two or these two, but we'll, we'll do it somewhere right in there. I'm still thinking about, maybe I will take out that back area and put more people in. Because these guys are all going to commute out to the other cities for a commercial too, so... 
Maybe we will do that here. Take this out. Demolish that, and that, and that, and that. And put in residential. Do the same on this side. There we go, and um, right here. Put a clinic near the mega towers. I could, little Reuben, but um, I don't think that it's going to help all that much because my clinic now is is covering most of the city really well, and it's not um, it's not anywhere near capacity. So, or my I guess it's a hospital. It's not a clinic, but you know what I mean. And some trees. Do the same back here. So my original plan to not have any people outside of the mega towers didn't really work because we just need so many more people in the city. But now we might actually have too much, so let's do this. Let's tease on these. And we'll put commercial in. Because commercial is going to help our, our Omega money as well. Do it like that. And then we'll do the same on this side. I think that will help out a lot. That's actually going to be all medium wealth commercial, isn't it? And low wealth is what I really need. Dang it. All right. <laughs> We're going to rezone this yet again. So this was supposed to be that. And this was supposed to be this. There. And this side. Commercial. And residential. There. Now we'll actually, hopefully, get our low wealth commercial. A little bit of it might be medium, but that's okay. I'm going to rather have medium wealth people and low wealth commercial. Ooh, we can finish doing this. And then that should hopefully help reach most of the water in here. This little part in the middle might be a little bit low, but that's okay. All sorts of lovely black and purple smoke coming out of the, the center of this the town. And our traffic is kind of going haywire for a little bit while everything refigures itself out. Hopefully we'll send some of our students to other cities pretty smoothly. It looks like there's quite a few people using the 
tunnel over here. I'd like to see that. There we go. Now we're much closer in our jobs. Still have a lot of unsatisfied people, but I don't know how much I believe that. Because commercial demand's coming down, you know, it's on its way down, and um, these buildings, it's, uh, they always seem so touchy for the mall level. So you get just barely, le you know, low enough of a certain wealth, and boom, you know, all of a sudden nobody wants to to shop there. It's it's really weird. Let's see here. So this one talking about being sick. This one no work. Okay. No work. This tower's great. What about these two. And these guys are just sick. You need a doctor. Sick. Have to move out. Okay. Like I said, we'll fix that one on our next episode. So I'm going to let the city run for a little bit, the other city run for a little bit, and get that research done uh, in between streaming sessions here. This is probably the last uh, streaming session I do for the Midway region for tonight, but I'll probably be doing a stream later on today with Mr. Play. So we'll do a, a you know cooperative region type deal. Omega's looking a lot better, 56,000 an hour. We did make a pretty cool little view here. <laughs> Let me get rid of that. Looks pretty nice. There you go, now you can see all the purple smoke. <laughs> and most everybody's happy. You, what is your problem? Not enough Omega, okay. Speaking of, let's check these out. 6,000 a day. 7,000 a day. 6,000 a day. Okay. Hopefully those will end up producing a little bit more as the city continues to grow. Not enough Omega. Hmm. It's kind of weird because we're producing a lot of Omega and it should have no trouble getting around the city. I mean, there's some traffic, but it's not that bad. here. Got that all pretty much taken care of. People still unsatisfied, I guess. Which is dumb because these towers... Oh no, they're, they're fine now. Everything else looks good, it's just for some reason the tops of these tat well, it's the sick ones and then these guys are like no work, which is weird. Let's fix this real quick. Replace the apartment level and then we'll put the power back up. Hello, View and Alpha. Yep, we're still working on this city. In fact, we're almost at the end of this episode as I build the power crown on here. And this city is pretty close to done, but we redid these whole back areas to be residential. Um, and back here, to be residential instead of industrial. Because we just need so much, so many people.
We are making a pretty good amount of money. Our mega towers don't make money, but they're not. I'm not. Uh, I don't require them to. But we're, we are making a ton of money on Omega, which uh, is still still kind of spooling up. We have a lot of a lot of it still gearing up in the city. We have, we have room for ex um, more Omega to be produced in each of the factories. So. But with that, we'll call that the end of this episode. I hope you've enjoyed. If you want to catch what I do live, follow me on Twitch, and you'll see it when I do it. <laughs> uh, same thing with YouTube. If you want to watch what I do after the fact, I, I make everything available on YouTube. So you can always subscribe to my channel there, and you'll see the videos when I post them if you miss me live. So until later, I, will, I hope, hope you've enjoyed my stream.